for watching Dear Angel. Dear Angel, do you think the government should continue to give money to support the arts? I happen to like the arts, thank you very much. I like to sing, I like to dance, sometimes I even like to draw pretty pictures. So of course I want the government to help me pay for things, right? By help? I simply mean the government should use tax money for this. And of course, if people don't pay taxes, they'll be thrown in jail at gunpoint. So in other words, if I choose to sing, dance, or draw stuff, the government should force other people to give me their money or else go to jail. Hmm, that sounded nicer at the beginning. When the government gives money towards the arts programs, they're forcing other people to pay their own money for those things. Now, I believe the arts are good for society, but other people like science or fitness or restaurants or movies. Should the government force people to pay for everything that other people see as valuable? When this happens, people no longer have a free choice about how to spend the money they've earned. Is there a better way? Surprise! Yes, there is! Yes, there is! There is what? A better way! That's a surprise! Yeah! Let's make up two guys. We'll call them William the Worker and Adam the Artist. If the government didn't take extra tax money from William the Worker to help pay for Adam the Artist, what would happen? Maybe Adam could charge more. Maybe Adam would have to change his career and do art as a hobby instead of a full-time job. But whatever happens, Adam is still free to do whatever he wants. And William could then spend his money on things that he cares about. Instead of the government subsidizing stuff, what if the government let the people keep the extra money in tax savings? When people are free, they spend their money on things that they find valuable. If they like sports, they now have more money to spend on sports. If they like hearing me sing and who doesn't, then they can buy a ticket. If the arts are important, people will pay for them, just like they do for other things. But that doesn't mean that anyone should be forced to pay against their will. Usually, the best way that a government can help is to do nothing. This has been another fabulously artistic episode of Dear Angel. Please like and subscribe. Bye!